Very good. Is it He's flashing? Oh, it's a monster. What's up, legends? Dave Fisher with Pete here, aka Kiwi Sung Nam Ja. My mate Kane, or uh, CB Hunt and Fish, I think. That's a yep. photo. We're heading out to uh, Firth Thames, uh, a little bit of a spot X that I've never been to. We're going to try and live bait with a drone and otherwise just go for snappers. Is there anything else? Gurnum and shit? Oh, yeah, boy. This intro could be a fucking waste of time if we catch nothing. Kane's all rigged up. He'd already got his set up. Mine's in there, so drone versus land base, surf casting. I'm probably going to lose. Let's go. All right, we're all rigged up. Grab some bullet tuna from uh, hunting and fishing, Cambridge. Bro, there's so many sand flies, eh? I've got repellent on my car, I think. This is the bloody money. Those are those BBK hooks. Yeah, bro. Honestly, deaf and mean. Well, we'll see. <laughs> you might outfish me, but yeah, my mate Janu, he was using them when we went up north. Not there. Oh, not there, bro. He's gonna reef ya. Oh, he's gonna reef ya. Oh, he's oh, being no. reefed. Hold on, hold on. Is it not off? Yeah, I think so. I. Oh, it's a rat, a rat bro. It's oh. a rat kingy. Yeah. And he just like outfished the death out of me, eh? Oh no, they just seem to just have mean hookup, bro, eh? And they're just real good circles, eh? No bites yet. No bites yet. We've only been like what, five minutes, eh? Ten minutes, maybe? Alright, while well, I set this drone up, uh, I've said it already. If you haven't seen my drone tutorial video, then check it out. Alright, guys. So we're all rigged up. Drone there. If I don't tangle it first. All right, bro. So your job is <laughs> to hold the rod. It's the whole my rod. So all you do is just let it off. Yeah. So for starters, take the bail arm off, but then just hold the rod like way away from the drone. I just put it like nice and down low. All right, sweet. <laughs> that looks sick. <laughs> Alright, cool. Sweet. Oh, sweet. So, when I get out to whatever meters, yeah. all you do is just hit the bail arm off and also like give it a jerk when it gets tight so that it'll like pop off because it's mechanical. 160. I'm gonna go ages, eh, until the wind gets it. Oh, that's caught there. Hey? It's fallen off, the line's gone slack. Shit. Caught that, eh? The bail arm come off. No? What the fuck? Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, well, that's where we're fishing. I was about 200 meters, so that's all good. Yeah, so that's us guys. Kane got about a 10 minute soak on me. Um, we'll see who wins. Oh, the tide coming in. I got the other GoPro, probably can. That's fucking mean. That was um, Kane's idea. If it doesn't make it to the video, it was <laughs> I was in an electric winch. Oh, must be. 
<laughs> this guy's over there. They got long ass jumper leads. They must hook their electric winch up to the car battery. So I just set up a little sabiki rig here and bait it up. Hopefully not get snagged. Just flick it out. Try and pick up a little jack mac or a little car wire or something so we can try and put a livey out. A little bit of bubbles down there. I don't know if it's a fish. Oh, yep. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Hey. Yeah, boy. Get it on the bloody board, mate. I tried to use a mullet last time as live in it was shit house, but anyway, we'll try this guy. Is it it's flashing? Board. Oh, it's a monster. Look how big it is, bro. It's a that's my that's my foot for size, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we actually have a live so that's a bit exciting actually. So I'm kinda interested to give it a go. Is that your live team? Yeah bro, check him out. You moments later are those dudes gonna be able to get out oh shit they're gonna get in trouble soon eh? waves are coming in can't catch fish without bait guys so first wind in nothing let's put it out again eh? all right guys take two She's all on here. <laughs> now, as you can see in the video, I recently acquired a four wheel drive four litre Prado. You might be wondering why I hadn't offered to help already. Well, I recently got the Prado fixed for a sticky solenoid issue related to four wheel drive, so I didn't really want to risk it happening again if I didn't need to. See if the old Ford Ranger can pull that boat out, eh? Fuck. Ah. Jesus. Oh. Really don't want that strop to bust on him, eh? Fuck, that's dangerous. Should I just get my truck and just go to the top? Let's see what the Prado will do, eh, boys? Doubled up a rope, um, might just see how it goes with the oh. longer ropes. Yeah. Sweet. We need an extra hand, we'll let you know. We're getting low, boys. So basically, the boat and trailer were attached to a Sangyong Ute, which was then attached to a Ford Ranger. Neither of them were able to pull the boat and the truck out of the water. So we then attached my Prado to the front of it all. Now I won't lie to you, I was shocked with how well this thing managed to tow everything out. Honestly, I didn't even feel it nudge when we started moving. Admittedly, I did have better traction as I was slightly further up on the beach, but it still shocked me how yeah, easily it ripped all three of these off the beach, eh? <laughs> you reckon you got it? Well, we did it, guys. <laughs> Good shit. Alright, I'm not catching any more, so I'm going to try and put that livey out. Protection, guys. You do have to put your mouth on the climb, but it is what it is. Small price to pay. But yeah, because we used to use balloons as kids, and you go to use a balloon and all of a sudden, like, it's perished from just sitting in your tackle box for ages. Yeah, how far are you going to fly that out? Oh, yeah, not that far. I don't want it to get caught by the wind. I want it just to like chill out just by the entrance somewhere. Yeah. It's going mean in the old livey tank. Look at that. Oh, oh, righty then. Should be enough battery since there's such a mean as light wind. Yeah, so I've got four batteries, and sometimes you can get up to four drops on a battery. But if it's real windy, then you might only get like half. Huh. 
Hope nothing dive bombs that livey. <laughs> <laughs> Give it a big tug. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Whoa. That was a bit intense. Oh. <laughs> did you get that? I don't know, I think so, yeah I did! Well, it's probably unlikely this video will ever make it to YouTube. I decided to post this video to highlight that not every fishing trip goes to plan. But honestly, being able to help someone get their boat out of the water and just having a few laughs with mates and getting to share those moments with everyone watching this makes it all worth it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and assuming you did, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. It makes a huge difference when you do. And please leave a comment below of what you thought of the video as well. Cheers legends. Ken's got a big rig set up there. Oh, gone.